KTSSS S123 Social Studies. What is the scale of a map? Learning objectives of this video. Function of scales. Difference between a large scale map and a small scale map. Types of scales and changing scales. We cannot draw all the objects on the earth by their real sizes. Therefore, it is only possible to reduce their sizes on a map. A scale shows the number of times the actual features are reduced. Surely, you know the size of a real bus. But have you ever made a model bus? The size of the model bus is 176 of a real bus. Let's compare different scales of model cars. The size of a real car is 12 times larger than a 1 to 12 scale model car and 76 times larger than a 1 to 76 scale model car. We can find Victoria Harbour on both maps, but the map harbour in map A seems larger than that in map B. The scale of map A tells us that the Victoria Harbour on the map is 20,000 times reduced. And the scale of map B tells us that the Victoria Harbour on the map is 200,000 times reduced. Therefore, the Victoria Harbour in map A seems larger than that in map B. We call map A a larger scale map compared with map B. There are three types of scales. Representative flexion, linear scale, and statement scale. Map A, B, and C are of the same scale. The scale of map A is shown in numbers. 1 to 50,000 means 1 cm on the map represents 500 meters in reality. The scale of map B is shown in a straight line. Every section on the straight line is 1 cm long. It tells us 1 cm on the map represents 500 meters in reality. Then 2 cm represents 1,000 meter in reality. The scale of map C is shown in words. It also tells us the same scale as the previous scales. Different scales on maps are interchangeable. The scale of this map is in fraction 1 to 20,000, which means 1 cm on the map represents 20,000 cm in reality. 
we may change it into a statement scale. Simply cut double zero and change CM into M. We may also change it into a linear scale by the same way. Then put the correct unit and numbers on the straight line with a few sections of 1 cm. The scale of this map is a statement 1 cm to 6 km, which means 1 cm on the map represents 6 kilometers in reality. We may change it into a representative fraction. Simply add five zeros and change km into cm. Then replace all English letters by a colon. We may also change it into a linear scale. Simply put the correct unit and numbers on a straight line with a few sections of 1 cm. The scale of this map is shown in a straight line, 1 cm to 500 30 km, which means 1 cm on the map represents 530 km in reality. We may change it into a representative fraction. Simply add 5 zeros and change km into cm, then replace all English letters by a colon. We may also change it into a statement scale by simply writing 1 cm to 530 km. Understanding different scales on maps helps you to find out the actual distance and areas of places. Thanks for watching.